Welcome to America Reads Fun Learning Activities. We are college students who create learning activities for kids. Our fun activities are focused on reading, writing and math. Thank you for joining us to learn today. My name is Navya and in today's activity we will be learning about collaborative conversations. To begin with, we can think of collaborative conversations as listening and speaking techniques that allow us to engage in discussions with a variety of partners. The objective of these group discussions is to teach students how to build on one another's ideas and articulate their own ideas in a clear and concise manner. Incorporating collaborative conversations into our routine will help us to learn to work in groups, to share and support opinions, to become good communicators and many more. As Thanksgiving is coming up, I thought it would be fun doing a Thanksgiving themed activity. So, we are going to do an activity in which we talk to our friends and find out what they are thankful of. The required materials for this activity are different colored markers or sketch pens, papers, pencil and an eraser. Let us take a sheet of paper and then trace our hand on the paper with this pencil or a sketch pen. I would suggest you go with a pencil so that you can redraw if needed. Firmly place one hand palm down and fingers spread apart on the sheet. Starting on one side of the wrist, trace around your hand until you reach the other side of the wrist. Now, you can darken it with the sketch pen. Draw a line to complete the body of the turkey over here. Now, color a small black circle near the end of the thumb to make the turkey's eye like this. Now, you can draw uh, two ovals to make the gizzard just below the thumb. You can choose any of your color, red would be good. And then, to draw the beak, Draw one triangle on the tip of the thumb. In the middle of the turkey, draw wing with black. Feet will be drawn at the bottom of the turkey by drawing two straight lines. And at the end of the each line, draw three more little lines like this to represent the feet of the turkey. Now as you are ready with the hand turkey, just write down dash is thankful for and make two or three copies of exactly the same hand turkey. As you are ready with the hand turkey, choose two or three of your friends or siblings or anyone who you would like to ask and write down their names and the blanks given here. For example, Ellen is one of my friends who I would like to ask. So I would just write his name, Ellen. So here this sheet is for Ellen and Ellen is thankful for. Uh, now go to them and ask four things they are thankful for this year. As they say, try to understand and write down each of the things in the four feathers we draw. For instance, I asked my friend Alan what four things he is thankful for this year and he told me that he is thankful for sun, food, grandma and games. So I will just write down each of them in the four feathers here. The sun, food, grandma and games. So, repeat the same with two or three of your friends. Done with the fun activity, you can uh, just color it down as you wish. You can draw the grass over here and make it even more colorful to make it interesting for you. With this, you're done with the fun activity in which you learn how to communicate with others, comprehend their ideas and clearly articulate them. Thank you for learning with us today. We hope you come back and learn some more. Please like and subscribe to our channel and we will be back with more videos.